Hello everyone. Today we are talking about a GSTL formatting library as initiation 1 to 5. We are discussing a GSTL 5 libraries. We already done with the core library, XML library, function library and SQL library. The last library of GSTL is a formatting library. So why we need to learn this library? GSTL formatting tags are used to format and display text, date, time, number for internationalized websites. This means how you can write rupees in Indian currency, the French currency return number form is different, debt format of every country is different. So here we are talking about a country code. For example, Canada country code is CA, France, FR, India, right, IN, US. So that kind of country code is we need to understand for formatting of it. So formatting any uh, text, a date or any numbers in a internationalization websites, we require this GSTL formatting library. To use this library, we need to add taglib directive prefixes must be FMT and URI equals to http colon slash slash java dot sun dot com slash gsp slash gstl slash fmt. Suppose you want to format any number. So we need to refer now what are the formatting tags are available in this library. fmt colon format number which enables to render a numeric value with some precision or any format. You can also fix out a format. We will see an example how you can use it formatting of number. You can also do the parse of number means you want to print a number in a form of any number, currency or any percentage. You can format date also. You can parse date also and you can use a bundle that load a resource bundle to use by its a take body. Bundle is required if you want to parsing a number or a date in a multiple one. If you want to set any local, local means country code wise, internationalization if you want to do then you require the support of a local of it. You can use a time zone in a, India having different time zone, in another country having different time zone. So he specify the time zone for any time formatting or parsing action nested in its body. So you can set a time zone by the take fmt colon set time zone and store the given time zone in a time zone configuration variable. If you want to display any internationalized message then you require the tag fmt colon message. If you want to do some request encoding then you require the tag fmt colon request encoding which sets the request character encoding. So here we ended the list of a tag available with the formatting tag. Let's see one example of it. Suppose I am creating one HTML page looks like this. right? So I am written enter number. So I written here one enter any number. So it created one text box and one button. The button value is a format number. Once I click on button it goes to which file? Format num.jsp page. So let us open format num.jsp page. It's very easy so I'm not written every code of it. To use this library, which library formatting, we need to use a tag lib prefix fmt and URL like this. Here I'm using a core library also so I'm using a prefix c URI and this particular URL of it. Remember one thing, every file library of GSL you can use in a one JSP page also. So here I'm putting my number it will print as it is so what is the value of c out here c out value equals to dollar param dot my number what is the useful of this line param is an implicit object available in expression language what is my number here what is the text box name the name of the text box is a my number so when i am using here c colon out value equals to dollar param dot my number it will print the number whatever number i have entered by the user so now let's do the formatting of it so fmt colon set local i set the local as a fr fr is a country code for the french so in french how they write down number of it so i am set a local 
एफ एल यू इक्वल्स टू एफ आर इफ यू वॉन्ट सम कैनेडा देन यू रिक्वायर द सी ए हियर सो माई नंबर एफ एम टी कॉलन फॉर्मेट नंबर इज अ टेक टाइप इज वॉट नंबर एंड वट इज द वैल्यू परम डॉट माई नंबर वट एवर एंटर्ड बाई इन अ टेक्स बॉक्स सो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू फॉर्मेट अ नंबर इन अ करेंसी फॉर्म देन यू कैन राइट अ वैल्यू ऑफ इट सो यूजिंग दिस फॉर्मेट यू वॉन्ट टू प्रिंट अ वैल्यू ऑफ इट द आंसर मस्ट बी एफ एम टी कॉलन फॉर्मेट नंबर टाइप इक्वल्स टू करेंसी वैल्यू मतलब डॉलर वट एवर टेक्स बुक्स नंबर यू आर एंटर एंड पैटर्न यू कैन सेट अकॉर्डिंग टू योर टेस्ट यू कैन चेंज हियर पैटर्न ऑफ इट सो ना आई एम चेंजिंग अनदर लॉकल एज ए यू एस यू एस हैविंग अ लॉकल एज अ ई एन अंडर स्कोर यू एस सो यू कैन चेंज जस्ट सेट अ वैल्यू ऑफ इट एंड रिपोर्टिंग ऑल द थ्री नंबर करेंसी एज इट इज द लास्ट आई एम प्रिंटिंग अ वैल्यू ऑफ अ पर्टिक्युलर फॉर्मेटेड नंबर so by looking up this example you can see here the format number type equals to currency and value equals to this i am using here currency symbol dollars it will print currency symbol also and pattern i set like this format and variable fmt underscore my number then the last i am printing a formatted number by the dollar fmt underscore my number so let's see the example of it so i am running the index.html file so i am entering any number 456789 whatever number just i click on format number you will see how it will be formatted the output my number is this in a french they written a number like this design pattern is this symbol is this and uh, in the us i added a dollar symbol here and using peter the answer will be this so in this manner you can do the formatting of a number another example i am taking here so i am included first two tag lib files then i set a variable how you can set a variable c colon set variable name is today what is the variable name value value is a today's date and how we will get the value i'm using which tag here expression tag here so new java or youtube that it will store the current date and time so how you can format a date and time in india so fmt colon format date value is what dollar today and i want both both matlab date and time both and date and time of us so you need to set a time zone value equals to us and you can print a format date of both by this example how we will get the information so i am running the application so here you will see uh, date and time in india is this right now and the particular date and time of us is this so in this manner you can use a uh, different gstl formatting tag to do the formatting of date and time to do the formatting of number currency and any information so you can work on it and you will get the more idea of it thank you very much